Our 8 News Now investigators obtaining body camera video from the crash that killed liquor store chain owner Kenny Lee. Documents revealed Lee was driving with a blood alcohol level nearly three times the legal limit. 8 News Now investigator David Charns here with the new video, David. Yeah, and Kirsten, we do want to warn you that these images are graphic as they do show the scene of the crash that did kill Kenny Lee. As we've reported, Lee was driving a van full of high-end liquor on US 93 in northern Nevada when he crashed into a truck. Police say Lee was not wearing a seatbelt in that he was drunk. Now, among the videos we obtained from state police is this conversation between troopers about an issue Lee reported the night before. One trooper saying he had helped Lee with a tire issue the night before this crash. So my concern is that there's nothing, no issues with tires on the van. Yeah. Because he had a right rear flat last night, and I call it got called a tow for him. Okay. So I'm wondering if. A tire for them. You know what I mean? But these people said that he was just kept kept coming over in their lane. Oh, uh, drifting? Yeah, he like drifted in their lane. Drifting into their lane, he says their police had said Lee experienced a tire issue, but they said it was resolved. It did not play any into this crash, anything into this crash at all. They also say that none of the tires on that van showed any signs of malfunction. Two people in the car Lee slammed into, they went to the hospital. The bottles of high end tequila Lee was transporting that you saw there on the ground go for upwards of $200 each. Kirsten. Thank you, David. Lee's Discount Liquor owns 23 stores across our state. Kenny Lee's death in November 2021 came less than three months after his father and founder of the chain passed away at the age of 79 after a battle with pancreatic cancer.